and welcome to a new vlog. If you're new to the channel, I'm Sarah. The other half adults in Disney is Jeff. And today we are at Coronado Springs. We will give you a full resort review, which is gonna give you a room tour. We'll show you all the bars and lounges, the restaurants, the stores, and all the other amenities here at the resort. We can't wait to share it with you and it's time for another adventure. tour of our room. We are in the tower again here at Coronado Springs and we are in a water view room on the 11th floor. So we have a really awesome view. I'll show you at the end here. But first, when you walk in, you're going to have like a barn door almost into the bathroom, which I love. So in here, you're going to have a sink, all the H2O products. It's really nice. I love all of the designs in here. An awesome big shower. And then there's a pocket door here to the toilet. So this is gonna be perfect for us. I love all the finishes, it's really, really nice. And then out here to the main bedroom space, you're gonna have a closet here um, on the side that you can store stuff in. We have the two beds and they did a really cute little like Mickey towel detail. And then over here on the other side, you're gonna have the TV. There's a mini fridge and a chair. So a really nice room, lots of space. And again, I'll peek over here and show you guys the view after. Well, there's not a ton of Disney details in here. I do love this hidden Mickey right on the barn door. Coronado Springs is gonna have amazing bar and lounge locations. Right now we are in front of the Barcelona Lounge, so in the morning it does breakfast, but at night it's gonna have drinks and it's known for its gin drinks. So we're gonna go grab something there and then we'll share the other bar options here with you after. The Barcelona Lounge has a bunch of really great drinks, but our favorite is going to be the Elderflower Gin and Tonic. So as I mentioned, the bar is known for gin-based drinks. So it's a really fun bar. I recommend stopping in and grabbing a drink here. However, our absolute favorite bar at this resort, and honestly one of our favorite bars in all of Disney World, is going to be Three Bridges, which is going to be located in the middle of the Coronado Springs Resort. So right now I am standing at Three Bridges and it's gonna have three bridges that connect to this lounge here on the water. Their food is absolutely amazing. They have great drinks and probably our favorite drink here to get is going to be the Sangria Flight. They're all delicious, especially the white sangria. Rick's is gonna be one of the dining and bar locations here. They do breakfast, lunch, and dinner. And then you also have the bar where you can just go up and grab seats. They do have big TVs in there, so if you're looking to watch a sporting event, uh, this, I would say, would definitely be one of the go-to spots I'd recommend. Here's a quick peek inside Rick's. So it is going to have some tables, so if you wanna come in, sit, grab a bite to eat, you can. There also is that large bar I mentioned, and again, tons of TVs around if you wanna watch some kind of sporting event. Another bar and lounge that's very popular here is going to be Dahlia. This is gonna be located on the top floor of the tower, the Grand Destino Tower. And I'm sorry I didn't get any video from inside of the bar, but the highlight definitely of Dahlia Lounge is going to be the outdoor seating, which gives you some amazing views of Disney. So you can see things like uh, Tower of Terror in the distance. You can also see fireworks here at night. We just made it into Toledo, so this is going to be a sit-down restaurant here at Coronado Springs, and it is one of our favorite restaurants in all of Disney World, so I'm really excited to be here. Uh, we just got our table, and we put in drink orders, and Jeff and I both got the white sangria. Uh, we've both had this before, highly recommend it, uh, but I'm really looking forward to this meal and can't wait to share it all with you. Here is a look at the inside of the restaurant. The menu is going to be a Spanish inspired uh, menu and the restaurant is going to be located on the top floor of the Grand Destino Tower, so right across from Dahlia Lounge. And all of the food and drinks we've had here honestly are amazing. One of my favorite appetizers is going to be the pan con tomate, which we got tonight. We also really like their charcuterie. 
For entrees, Jeff went with a lamb, which was really good. And then I went with the dish I always get, which is going to be a chicken. It's really unique, but it's absolutely delicious. And then for dessert, we went with a cheesecake, which was also great. If you're looking for a dinner location, we highly, highly recommend Toledo. Another sit down dining option is going to be Maya Grill. Uh, personally, we have not been here because we love Toledo so much and we always go there, but if you're here and want other options, this is available. Here is a look inside Maya Grill just to give you an idea of what the atmosphere is like. And the menu here is going to be inspired by traditional Mexican food. When it comes to quick service options here at Coronado Springs, you're going to have El Mercado. This is going to do breakfast, lunch, and dinner. So if you just want to quickly grab something, either eat it right here or bring it back to your room, this is available. Here's just an idea of the hours for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Again, it's going to be more grab and go style. So they do have a little counter here. We can go up, order the food that you want. And then also along the side is going to be a bunch of different refrigerated items. So again, if you're looking at more of a grab and go food option, this is here. The Barcelona Lounge is going to be located in the tower and in the mornings it's going to have coffees. We just got an iced coffee which is perfect and they also have some grab and go uh, like breakfast sandwiches and cereal if you're looking for them. So this is one option in addition to the Mercado in the other area for breakfast. Here is a look at the menu here at the Barcelona Lounge. They do have a variety of specialty coffees. And then there is the plenty of seating here. I love the Mickey and Walt details. And this is gonna be located on the bottom floor of the Grand Destino Tower. So it's very convenient, especially if you're staying in the tower. And then another option for breakfast is going to be Rick's Express. This is gonna have some grab and go food options. I will say that they have a bigger variety here than they had over in Barcelona Lounge. So if you're looking at some more um, breakfast options, you can always come over here. Behind me is going to be the main pool area. I love it with the pyramid theming. There is a water slide, which is really fun. And then I do like also that you have the bar, which also will serve food. So it's a great place to relax here at the resort. In addition to this main pool area, there are also smaller pools which are located near some of the buildings throughout the resort and we'll show you some of those next. Here is an example of one of those separate pools. So these again are going to be located throughout Coronado Springs and they'll be much closer to some of the buildings located throughout the resort. In addition to these pools, there's also going to be seats and hammocks along a lot of the beach area. So if you want to either sit in the sand or play in the sand or just relax in the hammocks, these are also available and really nice. And then overall, we really enjoy just the aesthetics of the Cornell Springs Resort. It's very nice. And one of our favorite things is that throughout the resort, there are a ton of hidden mickeys so i love all of the hidden mickey details some of them are a little bit more obvious such as this one here located in the artwork but then some of the other ones are going to be a little more subtle like this one that's hidden in the elevators but there's such a fun detail there's one gift shop here at coronado springs that serves both the tower as well as the other buildings that's right behind me it's a pretty good sized gift shop and they're going to have a variety of merchandise including some coronado springs items so if you're looking for a souvenir i would definitely recommend popping in Here is going to be an overview of the store. So as I mentioned, it's a pretty good sized store for a Disney resort with a variety of items. The Coronado Springs specific merchandise is really nice. So again, if you're looking for something tied to the resort specifically, that's gonna be available. They're also gonna have a whole bunch of Disney merchandise. One area that I really liked is they have a bunch of Coco merchandise right now, which is really fun. And then they are also going to have a bunch of food items. So if you're looking for a snack or something to bring home, uh, they do have a lot of food-based souvenirs here as well. We wanted to share our overall thoughts about Coronado Springs. It is one of our favorite moderate resorts. We especially love the rooms in the tower. So those are beautiful with still a few tiny Disney details in there. The resort itself has some of our favorite bars and lounges. 
So that is a huge plus for us. And then of course we also love Toledo. So the resort overall is really great. I'd say the one big downside for this resort is that you have to take a bus to all of the theme parks. So that definitely is a downside, but overall we had an amazing time. Thanks for following along with us and we can't wait to bring you on our next adventure.